<laughs> I'm a little bit nervous, there's no denying it. I've got a dry mouth all of a sudden. Me personally, I'm feeling very nervous. I feel as though I'm having my job interview all over again. <laughs> it will be a good experience and a good opportunity, I'm sure. I'm eager to get in there, I'm eager to put my point across and we'll just see what the outcome is. I think it will be a very positive day. I'm looking forward to it. Quite keen to, to um, show how excited I am about this project. Our project is mainly setting up a one-stop stone clinic for patients who suffer from kidney stones or loin pain. I'm very enthusiastic about my project and I hope that they will be as well. So I have two projects, two ideas. Uh, the first is a little bit radical. It involves sponsorship within the NHS. I'm talking about mass marketing of each department, of sponsoring each section of the building to raise funds to try and fight the deficit we're facing. So the project I'm presenting today is uh, some software that we've created at the medical school in Manchester. What I want is the organisational backup and that business intelligence that will allow us to take this forward. That's great, yeah, it's really good, yeah, very supportive. We had a, you know, a very good discussion, how we can uh, make it work, uh, we had a great ideas from them. That was wonderful, it was a very positive experience. Um, everyone on the board was uh, extremely helpful and enthusiastic about my ideas. That was good, uh, I enjoyed it, it was a nice opportunity to see faces I've never seen before and basically an opportunity to present some new ideas. What's really nice about the process is that people on the ground floor actually have a chance to make a difference. So I think it's been brilliant. I'm looking at using ECG technology as an alternative to chest x-rays for confirming the place of peripheral uh, inserted central catheters. It's going to reduce the time uh, of patients off the ward going for x-ray, the cost of the x-ray and therefore providing a more efficient service all around. It's all about um, data cleansing. There's been so many missed appointments and um, I'm hoping that the data cleansing will stop the uh, missed appointments from that, that side. We're hoping to get out of the way to uh, put a strong opinion across of recycling, of, uh, of like say starting anything, whether it be big or small scale at Trolley Hospital. I'm hoping to uh, like I said meet the, uh, the execs and uh, hopefully get some interesting information back from them maybe as well. Hopefully they can help us out. I'm currently leading the hospital's OPAT service which is the outpatient antimicrobial um, treatment service. I'm here today to ask for us help to get an electronic patient management system for our patients and that can solve a lot of our problems I believe. How did it go? They're very positive, it's, it seems to be a no-brainer, they're on board and uh, we'll just uh, see what happens in the future now. It went very well actually, yeah, they were um, very impressed and uh, they were willing to take it further. It was very positive. Um, everyone seemed really interested and very supportive of my idea, so I'm very relieved that it's over too, actually. <laughs> I've got the support in moving this forward that I need to develop my business case and they will help me uh, with that, with the with my pointers of what I need to, to, to look at, but yeah, um, very positive feedback, so I'm really, really pleased. Absolutely fantastic. The passion of every person who came to present today was overwhelming. I'm leaving here really enthused and, and committed to developing and implementing many of the things that we talked about today. What stood out for me most as a clinician was a lot of the ideas that we're hearing from other staff groups are actually applicable across the whole trust. It was great, it was inspirational. We had presentations from a whole range of people and it demonstrates that there are people out there who care about this organisation, care about how to improve this organisation, which ultimately improves the care for patients. People have thought beyond their own role into how their ideas can contribute to benefits across the whole trust. There's not one that we will not take forward. Um, every single one of them affects and supports the services we deliver, but for patients, and that's what means a lot to me.